What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video. It is 6pm on Sunday. We've already uploaded the video, of course, earlier on today with regards to the brand new players in packs, the new signature signing players. Man, all these uh, promos, sometimes hard to keep, uh, keep on top of. Oh, Premier League player. Who is it? The Premier League player is here, Oxford, Luis Miller. The foundations. Where is he? Who is he? Manquilo. Wow. Yeah, that's a really interesting card, to be fair. 86 rated. Obviously, you've got to use Premier League players in the uh, managerial masterpiece. Wins six matches by two goals. Score 30. Assist 20. Assist with a through ball in five. And score with a volley in eight separate matches. Much like all of these players so far. Defrel. The other two that were there. This just isn't worth it. Eight volleys. No, that's not true. A volley in eight separate matches. Do you know how actually ridiculously hard that's going to be? That's that's a silly, silly, silly objective that is. Eight, three would have been sufficient or four, not eight. That's crazy. Now, let's have a look at his card. How good is his card? Three star, three star, medium, medium work rates. 95 acceleration, 90 stamina. Really good defensive stats. Very well rounded dribbling for a fullback as well. 90 crossing, which is nice. His positioning and shot power is good. His short pass and long pass is right. His curves right, but he's got terrible vision. Quite poor strength as well. It's, it's not a bad card, but I, I think that's a lot. Like a lot. Like a lot for, for a player like that. And then, ooh, Chiellini. Let's have a look what's there. Any new icons today? No new icons today. Any new League SBCs at 6pm? Probably Thursday for League SBCs, of course. And then Black Friday. So, Chiellini is there. It's flashback Chiellini. It's three segments. I'm not going to have a look at it just yet. Daily Login Challenge 3 is there. 85 plus upgrade is there. What's that going to cost? 83 rated with an inform. Hmm. I don't know if uh, that's necessarily good value or not. But let's go and build it. We, will, of course, will open it. 83 rated with an inform. What have we got? Got a whole bunch of 84s, that's for sure. All right, 83 rated. Try and stick to the major leagues. Um, of course, we can use two 82 rated cards. Uh, Jose Gaia. We can go Premier League, Premier League, Premier League. Premier League, and let's just go and get a Premier League in form, I suppose. I'd be surprised if I didn't have one. Uh, house. There we go. We'll pop him in instead of Gaia. We only need 55 chemistry here. So it shouldn't be too difficult. Pop him there. Swap him there. Pop Pope down there in goal. Pickford over there. And that is the 85 plus rated rare player. It's quite it's quite expensive to be fair. An 83 rated with an inform is is pretty uh pretty intense. Anything else floating around here? No. Um so obviously the daily challenge, which has generally been just like six bronze cards, and this one. Eight players altogether. Wow. Hey, they're getting a bit a bit more testing with this. Two rare gold players pack is the re reward, but there you go. And then Chiellini. Ooh. Flashback Chiellini, medium high work rate, six foot two, three star weak foot, good pace, very good physicals, perhaps a little low on stamina, but for a centre back, it's not the end of the world. Very good defending, great reactions and composure, brilliant passing for a fullback, for, sorry, for a centre back as well. Can't shoot, but that is a very cool card. Three segments. This is for his uh, debut season, what, 16 years ago. Three segments. An 82 rated with an inform. No. An 82 rated with a Juventus player and a signature signings player. An 83 rated with a Serie A player with 60 chemistry. And an 84 rated with an Italian and a team of the week. That's not bad at all. That really isn't bad. Um, I think an 84 with a team of the week is like, what, 60, 70k? An 83 rated, like, what, 15k max? And then depending on the signature signings player... Um, you've got that that going on there. I do quite like the cards that we've got here today. 
Um, let's have a little quick look. Let's go to new players. Mankilo and Chiellini. Mankilo is an interesting one. What have they done to him? They've given him 20 pace, 13 dribbling, 13 physical, 12 defending, 12 shooting, 12 passing. Do you know, dare I say this, how tall is he? 5'10", dare I say this, he would be much better suited as a centre-back. With a shadow, he becomes a 92 rated fullback. That's quite nice. With an anchor, a 90 rated. I don't know what the fullback, centre back, you know, fullback, the centre back is looking like these days. But at centre back, with those cracking defensive stats, cracking physicals, and great pace, he might just be good. With a shadow, he is very good. He, I mean, he, he is. I don't know if he's even necessarily arguably the best right back in the Premier League, to be fair, because that Trent card is very good. Not left backs, please. Right backs. Yeah, that Trent card is very good. That James card is all right. He's quite nice, actually, that James card. And then, obviously, uh, Carl Walker and Cancelo are both decent, but this Trent card is probably... Actually... Actually... Trent versus Mankilo here... Mankilo's got the same pace, one more dribbling, one more defending, three more physical, eight less passing, and doesn't have a four-star weak foot. Shooting, not really that relevant. He's got five more acceleration, five less sprint speed. Shooting, let's not even look at. Better short passing, better curve, better crossing, much worse long passing, and much worse vision. And I think this vision stat might make him like unbearably bad. More agility, same balance, less reactions and ball control, more dribbling, a little, well, fair bit less composure. More defensive awareness, more side tackle, same stand tackle, one less heading accuracy, better interceptions, only just. Same stamina, more strength and aggression, and a bit more jumping. He's comparable to this Trent. I don't think he's quite as good as this Trent. And obviously, he doesn't necessarily have the same links as this Trent. You know, there's very few Newcastle players you can link to him. And I mean, there's a lot of Spanish players you can link to him, but not necessarily in the Premier League, whereas Trent has a lot better links. You know, Mane, Salah, Firmino, blah, blah, blah. All the, you know, Gomez, Van Dijk, etc. Um, but upon reflection of Mankilo's in-game stats, he's actually quite good. Actually very good, I would say. So uh, although he will be a pain in the bum to get, isn't it fitting as well that they they require eight volleys, but his volleys are 46? Quite funny. And then Chiellini here, guys, compared to his 86, he has been given 12 pace, one positioning and finishing two-shot power, 12 agility, 13 balance, and then otherwise a good defense, uh, sorry, good dribbling boost, three negative on the defense, one negative on the physical, but actually, it's not that bad. He's only lost one jumping, one strength, one aggression, and he's gained seven stamina, He's gained a massive passing upgrade as well. This is a decent card. An anchor is very nice. Very nice. A shadow, very nice as well. This is a decent card. Depending on the price of the signature signing cards, let's have a little look at them. Um, go. What is the price of these cards now? Jimenez down in the 30s. Yeah, Edwards down in the 30s. They've settled down to about 30k. Um, so Kramaric 30 as well. Lorente 560. Room Diaz only 180. So you could you could spend about 30k there. So for the price of um, you're right, buddy. You got some sweeties, have you? For the price of that segment, this is a good setup. 50k for this squad, 84 with an inform, like 15k for this, and maybe like 50k for this. It's saying 80k, but it's definitely not. It's definitely coming in way cheaper. You want some help with that? Yeah? Yeah, say hello to the video. Come say hi. Hi. Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Say I love you. I love you. Say bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs> See you later, buddy. Um, yeah, I don't think this is actually going to come in at 80k. If the if the the player is 30k, the uh, signature player is 30k, an 82 rated squad with 65 chemistry is like, what, 10k. So you're probably looking at 45k here, 45k. It's probably going to be at 120, 110 to 120 for this Chiellini. 
I think that's not bad at all. That, though, guys, is going to be the end of the video for now. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.